Hi everyone and thanks for stopping by at my channel again and this time I'm thinking of doing a video showing my current collection uh, as it is just the first days days of the 2021 I'm thinking of doing a video showing what's in my collection for as we left 2020 and uh, I'm thinking we'll first have a look on what I got new in box then let's have a look on the built cars and if I remember which one I did actually buy I will show you the the cars I bought uh, and still have in 2020 and I'm thinking we could also have a look on the cars that I'm thinking of moving on uh, in 2021 okay so let's start with the new inbox ones okay uh, so we got the TT02B MS that one I have built so but I think there's currently parts for almost building a new one since I used so many option parts on that one the box for Honda City it's actually just uh, extra spare parts for the city turbo it's built and uh, I got uh, some other color for the chassis uh, that one is empty we have a top force original body and down here original big big body we got a turbo conquer body I want the 2001 body and a wine quish and we have a cat XLS with all the option parts or at least almost all we have a new inbox hot shot or super hot shot we got a monster beetle we got a big wig still in the plastic we got a box with spares spares and spares so it's just empty boxes with or boxes with spares and we got a fast attack vehicle this one is meant to be for my night custom sand rail i think it was wasn't it oh yeah i think so uh, and honda nsx one of my favorite cars one-to-one -one cars really want one we got the blackfoot re-release we got my friends uh my friends uh pro cat we got the jägermeister uh we have the vajra vajra, vajra. we have the new inbox uh, rising storm we have the time tech oh let me show you the time tech frog this one is my oldest daughter's one we have the dark impact white edition and we got this one if you've seen my cars my rc car series this one was featured in it and we got an asterion we got bumblebee <laughs> we have a super s cute this is the old one 58097 we got the re-release top force we got the re-release super s cute another re-release top force and we have a terra conquer that one is just an empty box for one of the cars I built we got the new inbox Avante 2001 we have two egress 2013 we have a new inbox Vanquish original one not the weak US and we have a black special and we have an uh, Avante 2011 so that was all the cars I have new in box so let's move on to the built cars and as I go along looking on the built cars 
I will skip some of the cars but they will be shown later on as the same thing I did with the new inbox ones uh, so don't worry they will be shown okay so let's move on to the built cars wild villa 2 we got the farm king mini Z from Kyosho yeah and the body from a crawler <coughs> we have my runner NSX we have my daughter's uh, Hornet, Yun, I, don't, I can't uh, pronounce that, Yun Van Tabe edition. We have a Formula One car, it's a Lotus one. We have my Top Force Black Edition. This is my Nimrod Racing Dinostorm. It's been quite <laughs> quiet for that one this year but we'll pick it up we have a dusty aggress which i bought from my childhood friend and restored we have my runner aggress which i need to do some work on if you saw the movie of it uh, we have my aggress black special we have my terra conquer with an orange body no orange chassis we have my Avante 2001 and my Vanquish. We have uh, Egress, I like to call it like a survival. I haven't done anything with it since I bought it. For all I know, it might be full of spiders in there, I'm not sure. We have th another Egress, which is gonna be the Jamie Booth one also if you saw my my car my RC car series with the Jamie Booth kit which is there you would know that if not you should check it out we have a Dina Blaster we have an Avante we have my TTO to be uh, white edition MS car. We have my Rising Storm. Yeah, and we have my <coughs> runner top force. We got my childhood friends, uh, a super astute. We have my regular astute a regular dinostorm and my red edition of the top force <laughs> my money pit the blinged out top force we have a top force evolution we have a top force evolution built chassis with a new body there we have an original top force which needs a little bit work and my uh, astute replica as you've probably seen in my my RC car series and sorry about that the pro cat also from my RC car series we have the green TA01 chassis and also this one has the yellow TA01 chassis. We have this uber cool Renault Alpine. We have the Porsche 935 and after seeing Glenn's uh, <laughs> video on how to paint that one it's probably gonna stay unpainted uh, some more times we have the honda city turbo 
and uh, send scorcher. And of course, my fun car, the Cloudbuster. Yeah, I almost forgot my CR CR01 crawler. So we had a look on the new inbox. We had a look on the built cars. Now it's time to have a look on which cars I bought in 2020. And some new additions for this year is this Toyota f -Jode. It's an MST car with a CFX chassis. And another new addition is this one, Lancia Delta Integrale. Really love this car, it looks awesome. And this one. This one is meant to be my runner, or on-road runner car chassis. And I will uh, use that one and I will use different bodies for it. Uh, so I will probably have a lot of bodies for it. So I can just uh, change them for whatever car I want to drive. I love the look on this car. Such a very, very nice design on the car. So yeah, just had to have it. Uh, the chassis for this one, I might just sell as I got uh, another one, another chassis, which is fully hopped up. So I think that one would be cooler to have than just a regular one. Okay, let's start with this one. So we got an Avante MK2. We got the uh, Durga, the one I swapped with my M06 Volkswagen Beetle. And the latest car in is this one, the Kyosho Zaboon. And we have a Blitzer Beetle. And we got the Grasshopper for the Old Bug Racing series we're gonna start. We got my, oh, I love this car. My TRF 415 Mark Reinhardt edition. And we have another Mark Reinhardt edition of the TRF 415. And this one is the HPI RS4 chassis with a Tamaya RX7 body. Then we have these three bad boys. Let's start with this one. If you haven't seen my RC car series number one, episode one, this is my egress that I was that I found. I sold this in '97, and I found it. I found it and got it back this year. So that one means a lot to me. And as you probably know, I had that one back in my childhood. So that kind of explains all the other regrets I got. And this one, yeah, well, it's complete. It's not, I got the wheels, the wing and everything and extra spares. So it's a TRF 501X World Edition. It's a really nice car. Yep, here you can see the chassis. I'll feature that one in another uh, episode of my RC car, so don't worry. Yeah, and we got this bad boy. Look at the size of that one. 110, 18. It's a TRF 801XT. And yeah, just got it a month ago or something like that. And it's gonna be converted into brushless actually got the, the conversion kit by the, in the mail today, so I can soon start doing some fun stuff with that one. Well, come to think of it, I think actually this one also was new this year. I swapped it with the, one of the Dina blasters I sold, so 
yeah that one is also new i also got these two mf what's it called mf one x chassis yeah i think i should just mention this one not sure if it shows maybe there this one is a cool addition to my to my collection and it will be built like a ta02 with a carbon fiber chassis uh, upper and lower deck yeah that's my collection that's what i got um so no 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 i almost forgot let's have a look in my project box there are some car stairs also so yeah let's do that so we have some projects car inside here we got the team durango dx410 we have an original super astute we have a top force neo we have a terra conquer chassis with the orange wheels yay and we have what i talked about earlier the m06 chassis that's pretty hopped up which i'm planning to use for my m chassis cars no m body cars so yeah then we have had a look on all the cars so then let's just have a look on the cars i'm thinking of selling for 2021 at, at, at this point who knows i might sell more than these but uh, for now these are the ones i'm thinking of moving on yeah here they are so the hbi i'm thinking of selling i don't need two trf 415 market reinhardt edition so that one's going to go to dino blaster <laughs> i'm not sure why i'm selling this one it's such a awesome looking car and uh incredible it's yeah look it looks like so much fun not sure why i'm selling it uh maybe i should just keep it but okay um uh, we'll see we'll see and the avanta mq mk2 the df3 version it's a very nice car to drive really like those chassis but then again i'm going to build the white edition of the dark impact so i don't think i need that one yeah so there we have it the whole shebang or the whole collection um i hope you found the tour interesting and saw some awesome cars um, at least i do like them and yeah there are a lot of stuff that needs to be done with this collection and there's a lot of things that i'm looking really really looking forward to getting done so yeah if you also want to see then and haven't already subscribed please consider doing so and hit the notification bell to get an update on the next video and yeah thanks for motivating me to making these movies and i'll see you in the next one take care